Agrion. I'm Doug Staker. I'm Vice President of Sales for Demand Energy Networks. We build a distributed, intelligent energy storage system that we deploy behind the meter in commercial buildings. Well, I think what uh, is really leading the growth in energy storage right now is the integration of renewables, as well as some of the challenges with retirement of some of the older fossil fuel plants that are out there. So if you look at the energy supply chain, some of the things that are driving new thinking is how do we manage that supply chain a little differently and, and transform the model of a just-in-time inventory system, which the current grid is, into a managed inventory system that uses storage as a key element and providing that managed element. Well, I think the barriers that we're faced with is really just how do you transform traditional thinking and uh, traditional system modeling and uh, grid operations. That's why we would like to work in markets that are a little more deregulated, like in here in New York, where we think New York is a bellwether for uh, utilities worldwide about what the future brings to new utility structures in the future. Well, some of the trends that we're interested in is, is really just how do you transform to, uh, people use the term grid 2.0, how do you move forward into a grid that's more interactive rather than being a one-way generate, transmit, distribute, and use model to where now we have distributed resources, intelligent energy management, more data exchanges, more knowledge-based applications, helping um, orchestrate a different operating model than uh, is currently deployed in utility operations today. We're looking in 2015, we really think that New York, uh, some of the incentives, some of the challenges that are here in New York are really um, uh, driven by compelling events. There's fundamentally the, the Indian Point Demand Management Program that has incentives for storage to help offset the potential of not being able to uh, relicense the Indian Point nuclear power plant 30 miles north of, of New York City here and the challenges that would cause to the supply system. And by leveraging those incentives and being able to manage building load to drive uh, system response during critical power events. We think that provides a lot of opportunity, a lot of growth for us over the next couple of years. There are other compelling events that are occurring in the region where the energy supply system is constrained for one reason or the other. And if you look at market, market pricings and the emerging rev initiative, um, the PSC's initiative to drive new rate structures for New York, uh, we think that these opportunities will lead uh, and help us develop models that will be adapted in markets worldwide. Agreed.